Hey, everybody. Good morning. I hope everybody's doing okay. Um, I want to come on here and do some more vlogs. I logged on to Twitter this morning, and I noticed that Toya was trending. And for those of you guys who don't know who Toya is, Toya Wright um, was once married to Lil Wayne. She also has a daughter by Lil Wayne, Regine. She's currently going through a divorce with Memphis. Um, she announced three days ago that she is officially filing for a divorce, so that has been announced on the blogs. Um, Toy is also on a show called Marriage Boot Camp, which I watch faithfully. Next on Marriage Boot Camp, reality stars. Today is all about communication. I can't be controlled. I'm giving you everything I got. I know a lot of folks wanted me to talk about the whole situation with Memphis blowing up on her. And I chose myself not to do a video on that topic just because I'm very sensitive when it comes to divorce. And I've always liked Toya and I've always liked Tiny. And I saw Toya's name trending on Twitter. And I went into the trending topic and I realized that Toya is going through a lot right now. And my prayers are definitely going up to her. If you guys have not heard, her two younger brothers, Josh and Rudy Johnson, were both shot in a car last night in New Orleans, and they were killed, and it's been confirmed by a lot of the blogs. Famulus and a lot of other people have been confirming this. Also, Rudy has another baby on the way. His baby's mother also confirmed this on Instagram as well. So it's a lot going on, and I feel very, very bad for Toya. She's been going through a lot this year. <laughs> As of three days ago, Toya announced that she's officially divorced in Memphis. And three days later, both of her brothers were killed down in New Orleans. So this entire situation to me is just extremely sad. Do you guys remember back in 2011, Toya had a show on BET called Family Affair. And that's how we got to know Toya and her brothers. And she has a big family. Her mother was a drug addict, so she had a lot of kids. Her father has a lot of kids. So she has a lot of siblings on both sides. And Toya tried to play mother and look out for her younger brothers and, you know, show them something better than New Orleans. And it caused a lot of conflict on the show. And her and her older brother, Walter, were always getting into it. He had just gotten out of prison. So the show was, like, very dramatic, very real. And it kept everybody on the edge of their seats. Go ahead and check out this small snippet real quick. Upstairs, Nate. Step upstairs for a minute. I'm my thing is, to compete with you, and, and that's then not listen, my word. And that, and, and then, you listen. be round me. If you round me, you can know what come out the horse's mouth. Like when you was in, when she was in New Orleans, I was taking care of her. How? How was she saying how? When she, she has an addiction when she call your phone and you telling her you sending her money for a rent. She ain't paying that rent. That rent went to drugs. I came out my pocket to do that. That was me and him. Why are you doing your life? I got the world about a <laughs> on pop on her head. Or How you got the word my banana on top of her head and you bringing this no, to her house? No, no. she live at a game no, of no, baby. No, I smoke, I like my smoke, mama no, called me on the phone no, like she don't feel no. comfortable where she live at because you didn't brought your crew to her house Man, and posted up like that's cool. You. My mama has an addiction that she has. And I know like. that. And she don't know that. You have not been around her to know that. You have not been around her to know that. I watched the game she played. You don't know my mama like I know her. When you stayed with all your aunties and all that, I rebelled and it was me that had to be with Nita. Every day, okay, when we I have food that, and they have all that, that, you was not there. I was there. I'm on my way. All right, so you guys just saw that small snippet. So like I said, the show was very good. I used to tune in all the time, and I loved her brothers, you know? Like, it seemed like Toya was really a good sister. She was really looking out for them, trying to help them out. But um, the last I really heard anything about Toya's brothers were about a year ago on social media. They were getting into it. Toya and Rudy were getting into it. Rudy was, like, trying to blast her and was going on Instagram saying a lot of things about her. Regine ended up getting involved and, you know, trying to check her uncle. And it was a big mess.
And you know, like I said, I haven't really heard anything about Rudy and Toya since. And I really, really pray that they were able to put their differences aside and that they were able to come to some type of reconciliation for her brothers passed away. I really hope that they were back cool and that everything was water under the bridge because if it wasn't, I can just imagine what Toya is currently going through. They were saying that she was on stage last night when she got a call on her cell phone. She went to answer it and literally they told her on stage um, that her brothers had been killed and she broke down and ran off the stage. And nobody has really seen or, you know, heard from her since. And of course, she's not on social media right now because I'm sure she went straight down to New Orleans. So like I said, my heart definitely goes out to her. K. Michelle also took to Twitter this morning to send her condolences to Toya as well. This is what K. Michelle had to say. So as I get more information, I will definitely do an update on this story. But like I said, what I hear, they were in the car when they were shot and killed. And, you know, who knows what they might have been involved in, what was going on. But regardless of the situation, I definitely feel bad for Toya. I feel bad for their entire family. I couldn't imagine not only having to bury one, but two brothers at the same time. My heart definitely goes out to her and her entire family. This is just a really, really sad situation. And I hope that with this death, it brings their family closer together. And they can let all the hurt, the animosity. I hope they can let all the bygones be bygones and move forward to come together as a family unit. So anyways, y'all, let's go ahead and get the discussion popping. Go ahead and leave a comment. All right. Deuces. I remember how can I forget Ooh. how you feel? Ooh, yes. You knew you were my first time. Yes, Lord. How you feel? Ooh. Hey you guys, it's your girl T. Make sure to subscribe, like, and share my videos. You can also visit lovelytea.com to purchase any merchandise. Also, don't forget to click the boxes down below to watch any of my previous videos. Talk to y'all later. Deuces.